Hi everybody, welcome to another Yarn Scrap Friday with me, Laura, and in this video I'm going to be showing you how to make this teeny tiny little heart. Perfect for Valentine's Day. <laughs> Okay, so for this tiny little heart, we're going to be using some uh, DK light worsted weight yarn, and I've chosen red, of course. Um, but you can use any yarn that you like, really, for this pattern. And with this yarn, I'm going to be using a 2.5 millimeter crochet hook, but you can use any yarn and hook size that's suitable for the yarn that you're using. You don't have to use what I'm using. And it's also a good idea to have a pair of scissors and a yarn needle if you want to sew in those ends as well. Okay, so to make this little heart, we're going to take our yarn and do a little slip knot to begin. A little slip knot onto our hook and then we're going to chain four because we're going to do a chain four loop. So we're going to yarn over and do one chain, two chain, three chain and four chains. Okay, so we're going to chain four, then we're going to put our hook into our first chain so find your first chain that you made, put your hook into there, bring the yarn through the first chain and bring it straight through the loop on your hook. And that forms a little loop joined at the beginning and the end. And in the middle, you can see there, that's your first chain. Don't confuse it with your first chain. You need to find that centre hole there. But the first thing we're going to do is we are going to chain three. Okay, we're going to chain three. So one, two, and three so we're going to chain three and then we're going to put our hook into the center of our four chain loop so be careful not to go into your first chain which your hole because that can look quite big you need to find the center of that loop so just below your first chain into the middle you're going to put your hook and then we're going to bring the yarn through the middle and we're going to do a single crochet and this pattern's in us terminology so yarn over pull through both loops. Let's do a single crochet. Okay, we're going to do three of those. So that's one single crochet. Go back into the center again. Bring the yarn through. Work another single crochet. Pull through both loops. That's two. And we're going to do another one. Back into the center. Bring the yarn through. Yarn over, pull through two. To do a third single crochet. Okay, so we've chained three and done three single crochet into the center of our four chain loop. Now we're going to do two double crochets. So we're going to yarn over and we're going to go into that center of our loop again. Bring the yarn through the center. Then do a double crochet. So pull through two, pull through two. We're going to do two of those. So that's one. Go back into the center and do another one. two, pull through two. Okay, so we've got two double crochet. You might want to just keep moving our stitches over as you work them. Then we're going to chain three. Let's chain one, oops. One, two, and three. So chain three. We're going to slip stitch into the centre now. So we're just going to put our hook straight into the middle, bring the arm through the middle, then bring it straight through the loop on your hook to do a slip stitch. And that completes the first half of your little mini heart. To do the second side, we're going to chain three. One, two, and three. And we're going to do two double crochet. So yarn over, get back into the center, do two double crochet. Pull through two, pull through two. So that's one double crochet, do another one. Two, pull through two. Okay, so you've got two double crochet. Then we're going to do three single crochet. So back into the center again, do a single crochet. One, we've got three of these, so that's one. Back in again for another one, two. And the last one, three. Okay, so after your third single crochet, you just need to make sure it's not covering up 
the uh, chains at the beginning. So you then need to find the third chain of your three that you did at the very beginning. So find those three chains that you did. So one, two, and three, just about C. Put your hook into that third chain of your three. As neatly as you can. And just do a little slip stitch. So bring the arm through there. And straight through the loop on your hook. And that is the end of your little heart. And you can just pull center in a little bit. If you've gone through the middle, you should be able to bring that in a little bit in the middle. If you can't, it probably means you've gone into your first chain by accident. Then just cut your yarn, pull the tail in through, and there is your finished mini heart, like so. Perfect for adding on to anything. And if you want to sew this onto anything, what I recommend is rather than sewing over like that around to sew it on. If you want to keep the shape of your heart, I recommend sewing up and over the stitches this way on the inside so you're not going over the edge. If you sew like that around, it keeps its shape better than if you went over the edge like so. Okay, but you can make these even smaller. I swapped this, for, um, I swapped the 2.5 millimeter hook for a one millimeter hook which is absolutely teeny tiny and swapped it for an even thinner as uh, it's a cotton uh, crochet thread yarn and I made an even smaller little heart like so which if I compare it to this one you can see is even smaller <laughs> like so. So there we go. I uh, hope that uh, you enjoyed this tutorial. It's definitely embracing the yarn scrap theme for using up those little scrap pieces of yarn and I hope you have a wonderful Valentine's Day and I'll see you soon for some more crochet fun. Thanks for watching guys. Bye. Oh and don't forget to check out my playlist of Valentine's Day um, crochet tutorials. There's a whole playlist of different types of heart related, Valentine's related uh, tutorials if you want to go check those out. Okay. Bye. <laughs>